Control. We're out in Norwell today just testing out the rally art after a couple of mods that we put on it. Uh, we bought the car for skid pan and a bit of fun track time, rally days. And um, the one thing with the rally art is it, as a standard car, it's pretty pretty simple. The suspension is not that great in that. So we, uh, we've set about putting a couple of cheap affordable mods um, on the car and see what we can do in terms of lap time with it. So some of the basic mods we went through was tyres, number one, obviously. Um, brakes, you can't go out with a standard brake, so a bit of fluid in there, some decent pads and, and, and uh, rotors are supplied by Brakes Direct. Um, tyres was Nankang, we actually started off with a Nankang street tyre and now we're on a more of a semi-slick Nankang tyre. Um, and then we headed over to Keith for Wheels, got an awesome alignment set up, the guys know their stuff, um, put a good alignment on for us and uh, now we're going to go test it. That'll help us with all the products that we got for the vehicle uh, to get it installed and to finalize the whole modification. We went over to um, Rally Art and Evo specialist Alan and Keith from AK Racing. Hi, I'm Alan. And I'm Keith. And uh, together we are AK Racing. Racing. Dylan's picked up the phone, give us a call, and gone, guys, this is what I've got. This is what I do. What can you do for me? Um, and straight away, the list of things in our head is just like this, just never ending. But um, sat down, we worked out what Dylan's goals are for the car, and we came up with just a, a few simple mods that have transformed this car from, from a daily driver to a daily driver that can also be a beast on the track, on the skids, on the rally, whatever Dylan wants for it, this car can handle. Um, some real basic mods, so MCA XR suspension. Um, absolutely awesome setup. Uh, custom set springs and everything uh, from Josh at MCA. Perfect for the track work. Uh, that, that Dylan's been doing. Uh, we followed that up with our three inch stainless steel dual exit exhaust, um, specifically built for the rally out. So that's, that's our own brand. That's not a, an, an order in thing or something. We actually, it's our own design. We make that all ourselves. Um, and on top of that, we've done our AK Stealth Tune. We're talking uh, it was 33, 34 kilowatts at the wheels, um, but 92, 92 Newton meters of torque. So what we're talking is the t where he used to make peak torque at like 5,000 revs, now he's making more than that at 3,000 and it's still climbing. Um, that's a huge amount of torque and made it up with that SST gearbox, the, the six speed dual clutch gearbox in that car. This thing is an absolute weapon. Uh, and just a few simple mods, really affordable, easy enough to get done for anyone really and just transforms a car.
one downfall about the uh, Rally Art was that um, it's a very wallowy car, not very well braked, a little bit underpowered. Um, after these mods that we've done to the car, the car feels a lot more precise, very little understeer. The brakes were just right for the weight of the vehicle. The power is amazing. The power delivery shifting up through the gears is perfect. Down through the gears is absolutely perfect. Um, we started off with a lap time of 1 minute 11 seconds and we've just knocked off 7 seconds off that. I can definitely say that with the modifications on this car, it's, it's brought it to life. It's, it's what it should have been from factory and more. Um, it's, it's something I highly recommend for anybody who has a rally art. Definitely go ahead with these modifications. You'll be amazed for the little bit of amount of money you need to put into it. You'll have a car that you'll be smiling from ear to ear.